y'all doing? To my mom's channel, Eat Your Philly Phil. I wonder what she's cooking in the kitchen today. Mom, what are you cooking? You never know where your girl Philly Phil's gonna be. What I be cooking, what I be baking. What I be frying, what I be steaming, you just don't know about Philly Phil. I might be dropping some political news on you, entertainment news. If this is anyone's first time stopping by the channel, hey, thank you for stopping by. Make sure you like this video, leave a comment, hit that subscribe button, press that red subscribe button again. What's up, guys? All right. So, y'all like my new intro? We'll talk more about that later. That came from Finest Wine Cooking Channel, okay? All right, we'll talk about it. Actually, he had his last video was some baked chicken guys when i saw it it made me want some baked chicken so i am doing some chicken uh leg quarters okay <laughs> chicken leg quarters i'm going to bake some leg quarters and i'm gonna use some saison red pepper italian basil oregano you guys know onion powder garlic powder parsley and i like italian cut green beans and i'll have some tonis and my black pepper and we got some um bacon grease you know we be saving our bacon grease i'm gonna put a little that in that as well as in my green beans and some steamed white rice okay let me get this together i'm going to clean these real good season them and then sear them really good like he did and then put it in the oven is what he said but he didn't tell me what temperature i think i'm gonna do it at 375 all right let me get started okay the chicken is all clean you got to clean all inside of there okay got my veggies cut up gonna get ready to season this chicken now and then sear it real good in a little bit of that bacon grease and then we'll put it in the oven on 375 all right let's get to it okay guys the chicken is all clean and seasoned I'm gonna put it in the skillet skin down okay and I want a nice sear on them So, fine as I said, you know, sear them real good and then put it in the oven, uncovered, and let them bake. Be nice and crispy and delicious. Now I'm going to add a dab of hot water. Not much. Then I'll add all my veggies. Okay. All those pretty colors. Add a little bit more onion powder. And a dab of black pepper. And add some more parsley. You know I like to have my parsley on there. And some red pepper flakes. Okay, I'm gonna put it in the oven on 375 and let it bake for about 20 or 30 minutes. Right, guys, my chicken leg quarters are baked. 
nice and toasted just the way I like them and the veggies are caramelized all right gonna have it with some Italian green beans and white rice what's up EWPPG how are y'all doing on this Saturday night this video is going to be late I got a late start okay but hey I'm trying to get it in for y'all you know your girl gotta eat too now all right let's bless the food father bless this food that we're about to receive for the nourishment of our bodies in Jesus name we pray amen Okay, what y'all think about that intro? Y'all like that? Mm hmm If you like it, you need to hit up Fine as Wine. I'm going to put his channel up there. And also... His channel today and his last video was some baked chicken guys it looks so good he's the chef he um so he left me a message in the comments and he said you know to just sear it real good and then put it in the oven and bake it uncovered i baked it for about 35 or 40 minutes and it is oh my goodness it looks so good to me anyway guys okay we're gonna find out how it tastes look at this All right. Okay, yes, check him out. Finest Wine, guys. If you need you a new intro or something, hey, he put that together. And I didn't even send him anything. He went through my videos and put it together all by himself. And I love it. Okay. I mean, you know, it says exactly what I needed to say. All the different things that I do with my channel. So thank you again, Finest Wine. Hey, I love it. All right, now let's see how this chicken is tasting because you I have not eaten, guys. Whew. I've been working on videos. Okay. Oh, look at this right here. Oh, I love my onions and stuff to be caramelized. Mm, mm, mm. All right. And I got some uh, Italian cut green beans. I like mine like that. And some um, steamed white rice. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm. Mm -hmm. Let me break into this chicken. Oh, yes, and it's well done. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm. Mm. Finger looking good. <laughs> I'm hungry. <laughs> you know, um, these thighs, leg quarters. This is the most inexpensive piece of meat you can get. The chicken. And you clean these babies good. They are so good. I love thighs. You know that? Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mmm, mmm. Let me tell you, honey. This is good. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. It's good and I was hungry. Mm. Mm hmm. What are y'all eating? What did you eat? For Saturday. Because by the time this posts, it may be Sunday morning. But I'm still going to post it. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Dropping it. Mm. But yeah, you just have to clean these real good. I mean, you got to get in the crevices of them and clean them good. And hey, once you do that, cut off that excess fat. But don't cut it all off because fat does give it flavor. And what I did, I put a little bacon grease that I had saved in the skillet and I seared it in the bacon grease. Mm-hmm. And then I just um, added a little hot water to it once I had seared them real good. And mm, I put them in the oven on 375. Y'all, this is good. Down to the bone. 
<laughs> yes, indeed. And I love these green beans. I season them, you know, with all my seasonings. And I put some of that bacon grease in these and I just let them simmer for about 30 minutes on low. Mm. Mm-hmm. And when I say it's good, Mm. And I love those colors. Look at that. Look at that. Y'all, this is good. You know, I thought about frying some chicken wings. I said, let me bake some chicken, you know? And then after I saw I found this one video, I knew I knew what I was gonna do. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mm, mm, mm. When I tell you, this is good. Mm. And I like my chicken, I mean, it's baked until it's caramelized. And so are my veggies. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Delicious guys. You know, I was on um to one of your vet speaks live tonight. She did a stream yard talking about Tim Norman, Bill Cosby, and other things. But um I was on her live and it was really good. She does she has good commentary on the sweetie pies, Tim Norman as well. Mm. And there was a lot of people in there that you know, follow me as well. And that's what we got to do. Support each other. Mm-hmm. Mm. And she said, um, she said she'd be watching my channel. And she watches it because she talked about those, um, sloppy joes. She had people on there wanting to go fix them some sloppy joes. <laughs> But I said, yeah, you've been watching. You know about my sloppy joes. That's the second, second time I made them. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. So I'm sure you guys already heard of her. But if not, check her out. Her voice is made for that type of stuff. It's so soothing. And, you know, me, I'd be on there. I'd be... <laughs> I might butcher your word, but I, I'm trying. <laughs> mm, 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 mm. Woo! And I tell y'all, this chicken is baked to perfection. It really is. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. Charles and um, Monique went live tonight on Instagram, and I caught it. So I'm a y'all will get to see that. Mm. Mm hmm. Monique said, you know, from Sweetie Pies. Mo said that um. Sweetie Pass was going to get ready to come back home. They had been approved for more episodes. Another season. Until all that stuff happened. And I'm guessing she meant with Tim. That put everything, stopped everything. So, we were going to have some more Sweetie Pass, guys. Mmm. 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 Delicious. Mm, 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 mm. Can't I tell I was hungry? I'm telling y'all, I had not eaten today. I just been busy. No, I had a, a small thing of um tater tots from Sunny. My bad. Mm. Mm, mm.
I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, that was good. These green beans are good. Seasoned to perfection. But yeah, that bacon grease gave it a good flavor. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Really did. Mmm. I think I want another piece of meat. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Not the whole thing, but some of it. Mm. Oh, it's so good. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm going to try to cook tomorrow. I'm not for sure. Now, Michael will get mad at me for not eating all this skin, but <laughs> I don't want all the skin. Although it's good. Get this last bite. You know how you get them last bites, get down to the end? Mmm. 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 That was good. Okay. Woo, that was good, guys. I was hungry. All right, let me clean up a little bit, come back, and read some comments. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. Let's see what y'all had to say about the fish fry fry. That we had big bone buffalo, catfish, fillets, whole catfish, and fried shrimp. Yeah, your girl went all out for y'all. Okay. The Dreamer, some of my favorites, and everything looks good. Thank you. Finest Wine Cooking Channel. Gave me that fire new opening. Oh my goodness. Did you have to fry that, that fish so well? I'm truly drooling. Well, thank you. Um, this chicken was good too. Let's see here. Robin LaFears. I had catfish last night. Can't get buffalo ribs here in D.C. You make me want to come back to Little Rock sooner than later. I wonder why you can't find any big bone buffalo in D.C.? Nicole Born, our food looks delicious. Keep cooking and sipping in the kitchen. Of course. Cynthia, I'm in fish heaven watching this. I really enjoy eating steak and crinkle fries. Okay. Uh, Tasha Hawkins, Philly Field, that fish and shrimp looks delicious. Have a blessed and safe weekend. Love you. And keep the eating videos coming. You know I will. Jacqueline Wilson said, good morning, everyone. No, good morning and enjoy. Dana Carey, food looks delicious. I love buffalo ribs. Enjoy. I know. Aren't they the best? Celestine Moore, fish fry Friday. I am here for that. Deborah Tuma, okay, EWPPG and more. Fish is slamming today. Looking all the way delicious. Keep up with the great work that you do to put these videos out. Love you. Be blessed. Thank you. Portia said that a restaurant makes fish on fries and it was very filling. I know it was. Julia Martin, good morning, Philly Phil. Your seafood sure looks good. Making me want a seafood Saturday. Love me some big bone buffalo. Did you have you some fish today? Always keep me some in the freezer. Okay. Thanks for the delicious meal and keep cooking and sipping in the kitchen. Mmm. Let me know if you cook some fish today. Smitty Smitty for hello, EWPPG. Hello, Smitty Smitty for. All, all my Chicago people. Debbie Henderson, wow, all that fried fish and shrimp. Would love all of that except for the buffalo. Love R. Kelly back in the day, way back 30 years when I was dating your uncle. Keep on cooking and sipping in the kitchen, Miss Thing. <laughs> when you and Uncle Chief was dating, oh my goodness. Y'all was listening to that R. Kelly, huh? Bump and grind. B Sugar 100, hey Philly Phil, how you doing? That crunch to the fish and shrimp makes me want to make some. I was thinking you should do the peanut butter and jelly burger video that B Love did. She said she'll add it to her community post. Have a blessed day. A peanut butter and jelly burger video. Okay, you know, I saw that. I'm gonna have to, well, honey, if I can get on that post, I'm just gonna have to try to do that. I, it was, I'm probably gonna be able to eat all of it, but I love peanut butter and jelly too. All right, guys, if this is anyone's first time stopping by the channel, make sure you like this video, give it a thumbs up. No, leave a comment. Now I need you to turn on, no, ring that bell. 
Press that button again. Turn on your post notifications. Why? So you'll be one of the first to know whenever I drop another video. All right, guys. Again, make sure you go and check out Fine as Wine's cooking channel. Fine as Wine cooking channel. <laughs> but no, seriously, he has some nice looking food over there. Great recipes. And the music is, hey, you're going to love just the whole ambiance of the channel, okay? Y'all know what I mean. All right, guys. As I always say, you never know where your girl's gonna be, what I'll be cooking, what I'll be baking, frying, dipping. You never know what Philly Phil's gonna be doing. But one thing you do know, and you can run tell everybody I said it. Say, hey, Philly Phil, say we always welcome in her kitchen. Now I need you guys to keep on cooking. Hmm. And sipping in the kitchen. All right, I will see y'all later.